Napoleon Cerrone photographed every famous person who came to New York City during the late 19th century. He photographed presidents, authors, heads of state, as well as actors, actresses. He was best known for photographing Sarah Bernhardt. He personally made about 200,000 portraits during his life. Ada Isaacs Mencken came to Napoleon Cerrone expecting to have a standard conventional portrait of herself made. But as things went on, the studio session got wilder and wilder by Victorian standards. Napoleon Cerrone went to a party with a lot of artists and they were talking about the latest paintings in Europe and he got so excited and sort of so emotional when talking about art that he actually jumped out of the window. Um, it was only on the second floor, so it wasn't very high. Les célébrités ont une espèce de lingo, là, une routine qu'ils ont préparée et qu'ils préparent euh, depuis longtemps, qui connaissent leur profil, qui connaissent leur lumière. It's like driving a sports car. It's you just make little adjustments and they take it and go, and it's great. What excites me is the pictures, the finished pictures after. So whatever things happen on my set, however I interact with people or how whatever is set up, it's I'm not looking for a good time. People were lining up at his door to have their portraits taken. A lot of social lights and a lot of you know, upper, upper middle class, and all wanting to look glamorous and all wanting to look good and all wanting to look younger and thinner than they probably really were. And he would always have to accommodate that and, and put on his show and you know be his charming Cerrone self. Um, and I'm, I'm sure that that wore on him after a while. When I get a call for a job that, that makes me happy, yes, shit at the same time because it's awesome, but then you have to do it. So the first amazing part is getting the job and the second more amazing part is doing a good job. And when that happens, it's the best feeling in the entire world. When it doesn't, it's devastating. There was a moment where I had so much stress and anxiety by rapport to wanting to be marked and outputting des belles choses, des choses interesting, des choses interpellantes, that I was évanoui. I'd made hundreds and hundreds of portraits, but you know, only a few, couple dozen are great. I, I need to make more great ones. <laughs> 